I eat IDK how long I have, but I did the shroom detox water. Just put some shrooms. Like, now you infuse water with fruit and veggies and shit. I just did that with some shrooms. 95% sure it's working. I put maybe 1.2 grams. I don't know. Kind of feels like I'm on mushrooms. I probably let it soak overnight. And then I've been drinking it for like the past few hours and has to have been in my system for at least a few hours. I just took like a full serving, like maybe, I don't know. Yeah, over 40. Oh, shit, man. It really is working. There's no way it could be working, but I was, I just Googled like it. And as soon as you, you do like mushroom tea and shit, people do that. Like just put your shrooms in some tea. So I don't know. Maybe it did work. I feel like if, even if I say I feel it, I feel like there's still that sense of, uh, You know, you know what I'm trying to say. Placebo effect. But I don't know. I need the science to support that. It obviously works. But I feel like, of course, it fucking does. People do with oranges and fucking cucumbers. You get the nutrients of it. I feel like the shit that gets you high in mushrooms, that's, like, if you, the nutrients are part of the nutrients or whatever. It could, like, seep into the water. Oh, my God. I sound like I'm high. <laughs> it works. That's fucking crazy. Fuck Robin! Fuck Robin! Fuck Robin! I put, uh, well, first of all, I had some mint, lime, lemon, kale, just a bunch of shit, some raspberry stuff. I let that water soak, right? And then I had some other batch with some other shit. I let that water soak. Then I combined it, and then I put fresh fruit, and then the shrooms in that one. So not only was the flavor just really good, I think I'm going to make it like that now. I have, like, a pre-marinade before I soak them in whatever flavors I want. Yeah. Oh, am I seeing things? No, I was a person. Yeah, that worked well. So, hmm. Fuck. Yeah. Oh my god, so it's working. Lost my train of thought. The whole momentum just. Wow, life is a tide. I'm trying to find an American flag right now for this fucking thing. The good fun in them. It's not political. It's about having hoes in different area codes. Good fun in America. Oh, they love your soul in different areas. Something. I forgot. Oh, my God. It really fucking works. <laughs> I feel. Yeah, this is definitely the mushrooms. Fuck, man. I can't believe it. I'm downright shocked that it worked. I might make another batch tonight. Just add more fruit. More shrooms. Actually, I might let. Uh, how do I put this? Let that fruit soak deeply. Mmm. The longer it marinades, like any kind of marinade, I guess, it has a real deep flavor. So I guess I'll just leave the fruit in, put some more shrooms in, drink that tomorrow. Oh, I'm supposed to shrooms tomorrow. I might shroom tomorrow, but now if I do shroom tomorrow, now I actually have shroom water to complement it. Oh. American flag. Couple. Hold on, hold on. See what I'm saying? Shout out Walmart. That was uber convenient. Oh, and a pole. I don't need the pole. Do I need the pole? No, I don't need the pole. Oh, man. Okay. Woosa, woosa. I'm sure the thing he's working because... I smoked some weed and that feeling of the shrooms became much more suppressed, mild, meshed with whatever the fuck you want to say, with the weed. So this strongly implies that there was another trippy substance that I feel like it's interacting with something to the tango. And I'm not the only person smoking weed out here. God damn it. Somebody's smoking pot on the trail. The science says no smoking, people. And come on, there's kids around, families, etc. Point being, the shit really works. It's nice. It's really nice. Some cucumber lime water getting real trippy. Mm. If you're at a festival or something like that, you see what I'm trying to say? I know you kids like them things. You want to get real trippy at one of those? Just put some of that in your water. Hey. Hey.
forgot what the fuck I was going to say. Oh, man. What did I just do? The walk was dope. I want to say something about the shroom water. It's fucking amazing. I'm, I'm extremely happy about this. I forgot what the fuck I was going to say. Something about something. Man, I work a little too good, man. I did about 1.2. The reason why I'm not entirely sure, I definitely did 0.5, but then I added, like, a cap and a stem independently. And, like, I don't know. I think it was 0.7. I said what I wanted to tell you, though. Ah, fuck it, TTYL. Okay, long story short, just smoke the weed at him, and bam, his eyes were all twitchy. Like, imagine a stroke to the highest degree. He was having one of those things. Nothing was really working. They gave him a sedative thing that didn't seem to work, but I'm not entirely sure yet. We have to wait. But what we do know for a fact, this dog was all types of messed up, and then you blew some weed smoke in his face about eight times, and then he just perked up. Like, the doctor said it's either, like, the old dog syndrome or it's a stroke. Where they just like lose their limbs, eyes start twitching. It just looks like a stroke. Yeah. Insane. This dog could not walk literally 15 minutes ago. I blew weed in his face. My mom says don't get overzealous about it because. Fuck Robin! 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 Fuck